Hey guys, no need to fear the blue screen error. We have the solution to get you back on track. Just follow my screen to fix this issue. Now we need to click on advanced options, then click on troubleshoot. Now click on advanced options. And at the last, we need to click on command prompt. Now execute this command carefully. Type chkdsk slash f slash r c colon and hit enter to execute this command. Now type c colon and hit enter. Now type cd space c colon slash and hit enter to execute the command. Now execute this command type cd space windows and simply hit enter now type cd system32 and hit enter now type cd space config and simply press enter to execute this command now type md backup and simply hit enter now type copy star dot star backup and simply hit enter to execute the command now execute the command md space back backup one and simply hit enter now type copy star dot star backup one and simply hit enter to execute the command type in cd space regback and hit enter to execute the command execute this command type dir then simply hit enter now type copy space star dot star space dot dot and hit enter then type all and hit enter now type bootrec space slash fix mbr and hit enter to execute the command now type in bootrec space slash fix boot and simply hit enter to execute the command type cd space c colon slash and hit enter now execute this command type cd space windows slash system32 slash config slash regback then simply hit enter to execute this command now type this command bcd edit space slash export space c colon slash bcd backup and hit enter now type cd space c colon slash and hit enter now type this md space boot and hit enter type cd space boot and hit enter now type md space bcd and simply hit enter to execute this command type cd space c colon slash and hit enter now type attrib c colon slash boot slash bcd dash h dash r dash s and hit enter now type run space c colon backslash boot backslash bcd space bcd dot old then hit enter now execute this command type bootrec space slash rebuild bcd and simply hit enter to execute this command type exit and simply hit enter now click on continue it will restart your system so that's it guys your problem is solved and you are good to go